Can you all see that, the poppies? Yes, beautiful. Uh, yeah, so I just wanted to share the California poppies with all of you. I, um, you know, I think it's, we are over a year into this pandemic and um, it's been a long year. And sometimes, you know, and a lot of us are still working or staying at home a lot. And, um, and it's hard to still sort of like, I'm, I feel like we're sort of in a routine, but not quite in a routine and um, working from home today. And it was just like, oh, I was, I was feeling a little like just blah, went for a walk uh, in our neighborhood. So we have, I live in San Francisco and there is this beautiful national park. So there's, um, it's actually federal land. It's called the Presidio here in San Francisco. So it used to be uh, federal officers and an installation there. Um, and it's really beautiful. And now it's mostly park and they have these beautiful trails and it's springtime is finally here again. And these are the beautiful California poppies that are just all over the place and they grow in kind of all these sandy areas. So I wanted to just keep this up for our meditation tonight and share these with you all. Um, and then also maybe we could do a little bit of a visualization too. So when we, um, when we start the meditation, I might take you on a little journey and a little walk with me. Um, in terms of mindfulness, I was reading recently John Kabat-Zinn, who is sort of this father of the mindfulness movement um, in the US. I was reading an interview with him recently and part of this mindfulness practice is really trying to be present. So looping that into my experience on my walk today and just trying to be present with my surroundings and be aware of everything just going on and taking that in. It actually made me feel a lot better to take that little break and, and just really be in that moment. And it's something that we sort of have to remind ourselves all the time. It's, it's easy to sort of let yourself get carried away. And something he was saying was um, about your thoughts. And the interviewer said to him, you know, he saw this piece of graffiti once that said, your thoughts are not facts, which is sort of a good encapsulation um, in a way of a lot of these ideas surrounding mindfulness and when you're kind of letting your thoughts get away from you and then bringing it back to just being in the moment and also um, being aware of what's going on. And he says, you know, that's really a cardinal principle of mindfulness. Thoughts are not facts. Thoughts are events in the field of awareness. And you don't have to take them personally because they're not personal at all. They're like weather patterns in your mind. When you can hold all the weather patterns in the mind without identifying with them and recognize that the mind is a space that holds all the weather it can unfold and you can enjoy it or you can also bemoan it, but it's not you. So you're not caught in it in the same way. So I just want everyone to get nice and comfortable. And you can sit up and make sure that chair is just holding you and holding your body. And keep your feet nice and flat on the floor so you're well supported. And you can feel the ground beneath your feet and feel the chair supporting your body. And then lift up from that seat. Try not to work too hard, but just comfortably, if you're, if you're comfortable there, if you're not comfortable sitting up for some time, you're certainly welcome to lie down. And your hands can rest comfortably on your lap or next to you. You don't need to do anything in particular with them, but just have them in a relaxed position. 
And you can go ahead and gently close your eyes from top to bottom. You don't have to force them or push them in any way or kind of keep them clenched closed. If you can just let them close gently. And just be where you are. Take a slow, deep breath in. Notice the air coming in your nose or in your mouth. And then don't, you don't need to force it. You can just let it go when it's ready to let go. And again, Nice deep breath in, just observing the breath coming in and going out. And you can just continue to be here where you are in this moment, just with this breath, watching it move in and out. And you may have some thoughts arise or distractions that come in or in the background. And that's okay. You can just observe those things and let them go. Watch them and then come back to the breath. And as you're breathing normally and just feeling the breath come in and out, I'm going to invite you on a little walk with me to come and see these California poppies. And think about being in a moment where you're just experiencing being outside in the sunshine and feeling the wind on your face, on your body and the sun and the California poppies are there also enjoying that wind and sun together with us. So if you can picture there's a little wooden slatted path and there's lots of beautiful sort of sandy hills and some eucalyptus trees around you and no one else around. And there's rolling sort of mountain hills with maybe some houses and trees and buildings in the distance. But you're the only one just on this nice peaceful path, walking along. And it's quite comfortable Maybe you have a little sweatshirt on and it's sunny and it feels like spring. 
The sun is warm on your skin and it's been a little while since it's been nice and sunny like this. And as you breathe in and out, you smell the fresh air and maybe there's a distant sort of smell of ocean, which is there, but in the distance and plants and a little moisture in the air too, just with that nice springtime feeling. And as you breathe in and out, can you be in this moment? Feel the light on your face, on your hands. Think about the sun's rays warming the skin on your face and hands. And the gentle breeze that you feel through your hair. Very pleasant. And you're just gently slowly walking on this path, looking at all the beautiful things around you. And there is that little bunch of poppies that's growing right underneath a wooden step in front of you. There's just a little step in the path there. And the poppies are just singing with joy. They are so happy to be blossoming and have the sun on them. And you just take a moment to appreciate them and be with them there in that moment. And then you can gently step over them and continue on this path, feeling the breath go in and out. Imagining how your feet feel gently walking on the stone path with a little sandy gravel underneath you. Taking it step by step. And just imagining that sensation, what it feels like to take a gentle walk and just be present for being open to everything that's around you and taking it in. You take another deep breath, inhaling the smells and the scents around you. And there are some bushes over on one side of this path. And this is the time of year, especially when the hummingbirds like to come out. And there's many of them all over the park and there's one that's right there, hovering. They almost sort of float in the air, but their wings are going so fast, they look like they're floating. And it's just a few feet away from you, right by the bushes where you are walking by. And it is there observing you and you are observing the hummingbird. And then it flies away on its own, you know, doing its business and onto the next flower onto the next bush. 
and there is an immense sense of peace and belonging in that moment there. And you continue walking along the path. You don't need to be anywhere else or pay attention to other distractions that may be going on for you in your mind, other things or thoughts of what you need to be doing or what has already been done. You just need to be there and in that moment. And then you can continue to walk and focus on feeling how it feels to walk on this path with the beautiful rolling hills and trees around you and the sun gently on your face and your body and your hands. And you can feel the muscles on your face and in your neck and shoulders. Relax. In one area on this path, there's a spot where the path turns to the right. And there is a little enclosed area with a bench. And it looks over a field. And you walk over to the bench and you sit down there. And you just observe the field in front of you. So it's enclosed on one side, so you're protected there. And then on the other side, it opens up to a field of rolling almost like a wheat field, you know, where the wind blows over it and you can see these ripples go through the field. And it's a gentle wind, a gentle breeze, but you can observe the light reflecting off of this, these fields and the the growth there and have it how it blows back and forth gently. And just sitting there you notice the air coming into your nose or mouth, into your lungs and your body. And it's fresh and a little warm. It's just the perfect temperature. And then you let it go. And your eyes and your face are so relaxed. Your neck and shoulders are also very relaxed. Your hands are resting gently in your lap.
and your body is supported by the bench with your feet flat on the ground, being supported by it there. And at this time, all you need to do is just observe the air breathing in and out. And feel the gentle breeze on your face and your body, your hands. the warmth of the gentle sun. There might also be some quiet, but sounds that you might notice more now. The wind gently rustling through the vegetation and the bushes that were on the path there through the sand and the sand dunes around. Maybe distant sounds of traffic way in the background, or even possibly the ocean, which is there far away, but in the background. And you're able to really be in that moment and observe what's going on around you as you're paying attention to what is happening for you and around you just in that moment. And being present where you are You don't have to think about things that you're worried about or that happened or that you're planning for. You can just be there, sitting on the bench and feeling the sensations of your body. and letting the air come in and out. And as you take your next breath in, feel it come in. And you can send a little attention down towards your toes and move them a little bit. And feel that sensation as you're wiggling your toes. You can feel sometimes that activates the back of your calves a little bit if you're moving your feet around. And you can bring some attention to your hands and your fingers 
Move them around just a little bit gently. And then some attention to your shoulders and your neck. You can take a deeper breath and roll them around a little bit as we start to make our way back to this space in this virtual room where we are together. You can take another deep breath and gently open your eyes and adjust to where you are. And bring yourself back to this present moment in the space where you are. And the goal of this practice is, is really just to practice just that just where, wherever you are, if you're able to take a moment, and this is a, a lifelong thing, but if you're able to take a moment and just be present where you are, it's really helpful um, to sort of separate yourself from all this other noise and things that are going on. And really the only thing you have to do in that moment is just be where you are and allow yourself and, and you know, give yourself that love and allow yourself to be where you are in that moment. That is absolutely enough. And sometimes you don't, you know, that's helpful in terms of thinking about kind of the next things ahead and then the next things. You're like, oh yeah, I can just be here and just enjoy or, or just observe this moment right now. Thank you all for coming on this walk with me or replaying my little walk together with you all today. I really enjoyed sharing it with all of you.